Good morning, skiers and riders, Sugarloaf and Carabasset Valley. Hope you're ready for a great day enjoying the outdoors. It's time for your latest local forecast and trail conditions report brought to you by Mountainside Real Estate. Find them on Main Street in the village, and you can find us anytime on all your internet devices at WSKITV.com. Well, we'll start the day off with some great sunshine out there, uh, increasing clouds throughout the day, 14 to 18 for your summit temperatures, base temperatures comfortable at 25 to 29. You see a noticeable breeze from the northwest up towards the top of the mountain, which will make it a little bit cooler, but not too bad down around the base nothing to affect lifts so get out there and enjoy it today tomorrow a system moves through which will start as snow change over to some mix and then some possible showers and then do that in reverse heading into monday as things cool back down so be aware of that grab that gore-tex maybe an extra set of outdoor clothes and get out there in the morning early and enjoy that before the milder air comes in on sunday and then you can see for next week we get a chance of snow showers and light snow throughout the week with temperatures holding steady in the the 30s and lows in the 20s so hopefully that snow won't go anywhere and we'll continue with some great skiing and riding as well as any outdoor activities here in the main high peaks region birchwood interior is bringing your trail report check them out in village west 110 trails to ski and ride on 10 lifts getting you there 78 trails on the groomers list and we're looking at some nice pack powder and machine groomed surfaces are there's some hard pack out there as well some firmer snow as things have been cold and a bit windy up there you'll find the three s's moving around the base area this morning snubber skidway and sawduster as well as super quad and skyline getting going at 8.30 and the double runner chair as well. King Pine and Wiffle Tree Trails get going at 8.30. King Pine all good to go. Lots of grooming over on the east side. Uh, Timberline will get going at 9 a.m. That's the uppermost lift. you got to check out White Nitro and Gondola Line, ex line Extension uh, if you're an expert skier. Get up there and ski that. And uh, West Mountain will get going at 8 o'clock as well. You'll notice the lights on Kangaroo Hill from uh, the Winter Kids event. Congrats to all those, ra raising some great money uh, for some great causes. Scheduled grooming last night on White Nitro, Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, Narrow Gauge, Competition Hill. They were building bumps on Skidder, Wedge, Gandhi Line, Spillway and Sluice, as well as Hayburner, King's Landing and Haywire, Candy Side, Lower Winters Way and Boardwalk, and all the trails right around the base area all smoothed out. On the east side, they got out to Ramdown, Two Hall, Whiffle Tree, Hallback, Widowmaker, and Flume, Lower Boom Auger, Cruiser, Slasher, and Rollway. And on the west side, Scoot, Windrow, Glancer, Horseshoe, West Mountain, and good chance so pretty much uh everything so corduroy for all abilities out there get out there and rip it up get out there early for the best stuff cross-country skiing is fantastic at the sugarloaf outdoor center there is a race going on down there today for some high schoolers and the snowshoe trails are excellent as well as the fat bike trails and the ice skating rink is open as well Carabasset Valley Fat Bike Trails are in great shape. Get out there and ride those in before the warm-up uh, tomorrow, so just be aware of that and your tread. And today is the annual trailside cookout for the Arnold Trail Snowmobile Club right up in Eustis, just past the Pines Market. Door-to-door -door food drive is happening with the Sugarloaf Area Christian Ministry and CVA. So uh, if you find someone knocking on your door, that's what that's all about. Some great live music at the rack tonight, so take advantage of that too. And be sure... To tune in to our mountain report. We're streaming live at WSKITV.com as well as locally here on Channel 17 from 7.30 to 9 a.m. Saturday and Sunday mornings to give you the info to know before you go. Check out our live quad cam so you can see exactly what's happening in real time at the base of the mountain to make your plans and also check us out on social media, YouTube, and our website. Have a great day, folks.